Welcome all my 5B students. A very welcome, a very warm welcome to all of you. And uh, today we will cover the topic in Uni6. Uh, the title is Money Matters. I'm going to share the PowerPoint with you now. Okay, I hope all of you can see this. So this is our title, Money Matters. So it covers two meanings. Number one is about money. Do you all like money? I believe everybody likes money, right? <laughs> because money is important for us to make a living, right? Okay, and secondly, matters means things about money. So today we're going to learn things about money. Uh, Shiman is joining in, so I'm going to admit her. All right, so let's uh, move ahead. Now, if you have a textbook, you can always uh, refer it from page, uh, refer to it from page 46 to 47. So on page uh, 46, I've updated uh, some of the new elements because this textbook is kind of aging, kind of old, I would say. So I've updated some new electronic money matters into this uh, PowerPoint, which we all can learn together. Now, firstly, I need all of you uh, to say with me. You don't have to switch on your microphone, I, but I just want you uh, to say with me. Come say with me together. An ATM card, everybody. An ATM card. Thank you. I, okay. All right. In fact, you can switch on your microphone. Kao, you need to unmute yourself. Please press OK. Daiwito, please uh, unmute yourself and press OK. All right. So, Chiran, uh, all of you just switch on your microphone. We, we don't have many students here today. So, it's all right if all of you just switch on your microphone because I want you to read with me and learn some of these uh, key items in Money Matters. Let's say it again. An ATM card. An ATM card. All right, good. Can I ask uh, Zai Wei, uh, what do we use an ADM card for, Zai Wei? Maybe. Maybe. All right, to take out money. Thank you, Zai Wei. Very good. To take out money. Uh, you know, at where do we use this card? Say it with me. An ATM. An ATM. I, I believe all of you have been to the bank before with your parents and your parents use the ATM card to get the money, withdraw the money from the ATM machine. But ATM itself is already a machine, okay? Come say with me. Automator teller machine. Automator teller machine. Okay, now teller is a person in the bank, children. Teller is a person in the bank which uh, who used to work to give you money by hand. That's a teller. Now we don't need a teller. We use the machine as a robot to, uh, to distribute money as you slot in your ATM machine, okay? So children, let's continue. Now, this is my bank account. Do you see the name Mr. Lam Chong Pong? I'm showing you my e-banking account. Come say with me. An e banking account. An e banking account. A long time ago, when we go to the bank, we have a small bank book like this. But nowadays, the bank don't give you any bank book. They ask you to go online. I'm sure all of your parents they have their e banking account. But I'm not gonna tell you how much money that I've kept in my bank. I just wanna show you on an e-banking account, what are the things that you all think we can do? Chong Kahao, what do you think we can do on an e-banking account? Uh, paying. Very good. We can make payment. We can pay for bills, all right, children? We can pay for bills and we can transfer money. We can transfer money to other people. We can pay money to another party, okay? <laughs> Now, let's move on. Have you seen this before? Touch and go e-wallet. Come say with me. An e-wallet. An e-wallet. Okay, an e-wallet is an electronic wallet. It's in the phone. It's in the phone. So, you can use it to pay 
when you go shopping at grocery stores or shopping malls, or nowadays even at the market stalls, they do use e bank, uh, e wallet uh, to pay. So maybe uh, you have seen your parents using the e wallet. Haven't? Haven't seen your parents using e wallet yet? Never mind. All right. If we have a chance to meet at a school, maybe I'll show you my touch and go e wallet on my handphone now. Huh? So I use my e wallet uh, to buy things online, to pay for uh, restaurant bills. Sometimes I pay for my prepaid phone bills using an e wallet. Okay. All right. Let's uh, continue. Well, the next thing is the note. When we talk about notes, sometimes we think of a note would be PT or Samsung Galaxy Note. But I'm not going to touch about Samsung Galaxy Note. A note is a zibi. You get you get what I'm saying? Now this is a 20 ringing note. Let's say it together. A 20 ringing note. Uh, 20, uh, 20, uh, 20 ringing note. Okay, and I don't have to ask you. What is a trendy ringing note used for? Of course, you can use it to buy things. Can you tell me what other form of notes that do we have in Malaysia other than trendy ringing note? What other notes do we have in Malaysia? One ringing note. One ringing note. What else? What else? Five ringing notes. Some more. Some more. One hundred ringing notes. One hundred ringing note. I I wish to get that in my red packet, and don't forget about the five ringing. No, all right. So this is very good. This is a currency note. And then, oh, I put ATM card. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. These are called coins. Can you say with me coins? Coins. Coins. Okay, thank you. So, Chira, I'm going to just uh, erase it. It's not ATM card. Huh? Sorry. Uh, while preparing. While preparing uh, this uh, PowerPoint, when I use the copy paste uh, method, I make a mistake. So how do you spell coins? C O C O I N. Very good. I N S. Okay, can you say with me coins? Coins. Okay, so these are the coins uh, that we have in Malaysia. Thank you, and let's move ahead. Let's move ahead. <laughs> let's move ahead to the next one. All right, probably you seldom see this. This is also a form of money. It's called a check. Can you say with me, a check? Uh, check. A check. This is for businessmen. When they do want to pay their business partners in cash, they pay check. Now, if you look at the figure in this check, this is a very huge sum of money. This is like 12 million ringgit. Oh my, 12 million ringgit. This is a very big check. All right, let's move on. Let's move on. Now, I want to share with you uh, from our textbook. We got a friend named Farah. Farah is a Malay girl. And then she makes, she does mini business during the past Hari Raya Ideal Victory, right? So, uh, firstly, she got some pocket money, uh, she got some uh, green packet money. For Chinese, we, we receive red packet during Chinese New Year. For uh, Muslims, they receive green packet money, Qing Bawa, <laughs> during Hari Raya. So, she received 80 ringgit. Can all of you see 80 ringgit? Can you see 80 ringgit here? All right. So, firstly, when she has 80 ringgit children, uh, she helps her parents to do different jobs. Okay, do you know that uh, sometimes when we, when we help our parents to do some tough jobs, for example, uh, wash the cars. Have you helped your parents to wash cars before? Can you switch on your microphone and tell me? Who have, who have uh, helped your parents to wash cars before? No. You never, you never, Carl say never. All right, I can understand because it's a tough job. So I, I was offering my children. I told them if both of you help me to wash my car, I will pay both of you two ringgit. All right, and they say it's uh, too little. Then I say, all right, I'll pay each of you three ringgit. All right, if you help me to wash my car, 
for me. And then I, I told them, we have, uh, we have planted, we have some small plantation, um, not to say plantation, sorry, a very small garden at our home compound. And I told them to pull out the weeds. Pull out the weeds means weeds. If they help me to pull out the weeds, I'll pay them, each of, if, each of them, to ring it. So that's how Farah earned uh, some money from different jobs. She helps her parents to do some difficult jobs. Huh? So her parents pay her 20 ringgit. Now, all of you, please uh, take note that Farah has gotten 100 ringgit. Can you see? She has gotten 100 ringgit. Then she used it to buy ingredients. Ingredients means Thai Liao. Children, ingredients means Thai Liao. So she bought ingredients to make what? Do you know she made? Uh, do you know what, what food items that she made? She made sandwiches. So she spent 43 ringgit, 20 cents to buy the ingredients. Then she slept with 56 ringgit, 80 cents after buying the ingredients. But then, children, this is the biggest thing uh, for our attention today is that, you see, you know how much money she earned from selling sandwiches? She earned... 120 ringgit by selling, I would say, more than, more than 50 sandwiches. Then she earned 120 ringgit. She earned that much. And in the end, she earned. I want you to pay attention of the initial money if she does not do anything. Children, if she does not do anything, her earning was just 100 Bring it. Oh, ringgit. Yes, that's right. That's right, Kahal. But since she do some small business, she does some small business. Now you look at the money that she has made. From 100 ringgit, now she's making another extra 77 ringgit and 30 cents. So this is what I want you to try and do at home for this week. You have seven days. I want you to make some money by staying at home. Make some money by staying at home. All right. This is all this unit six about being an entrepreneur. All right. Make some money even though you're only 11 years old. But you can always try to make some extra money. Make your savings more. Let's continue, children. Let's move ahead. Let's move ahead. So I clear the drawing. Let's move on uh, to the next part. Now, I want to ask you, can some of you tell me uh, by, looking at this, uh, by looking at this part, can you tell me what other ways can you make money at home? I'm first going to ask uh, Zai Wei. Zai Wei, name one way that you can make money at home, Zai Wei. What can you do at home to make money at least by helping your parents out so that your parents will pay you money for the tough jobs you do for them. So name one, one way that you can make money at home. Zai Wei? Zai Wei? Yeah. So what are the things that you think you can do, Zai Wei, to make your parents like give a, a little extra money to you? Maybe you can begin, Zai Wei. Maybe you can begin. You say, Mom and Pa, let me help you to vacuum the house. And then after that, can you pay me one ringgit? Maybe you can try that, Zai Wei. Okay, next up, I want to ask uh, Chong Ka Hao. Ka Hao, tell me one way that you think you can make some extra money like Faradid at home. Ka Hao, what do you think you can do? Help wash car. Okay, very good. That's a good way. Help to wash a car because it's so tough. It's not easy to wash a car. You know that? You're going to get your whole body wet and dirty to wash a car. Okay, next, I want to ask uh, my dear friends here, Kong Zhenzhi and Fu Jiawei. Each of you tell me one way to make some little money at home. 
Okay, let's start off with uh, Fuja Wei. Come on, tell one way that you can make a little money at all. <laughs> wash dishes. Wow, that's too easy. We should wash our dishes after our meals every time. You, you, don't, you don't ask people to pay your money to wash your own dishes. Okay, but maybe children, children, listen up. Both of you help one of your parents to wash all the clothes, to dry all the clothes, to collect the dry clothes, and to fold all the clothes. Then maybe you can ask for one or two ringgit. All right, that could be one way. So children, let's move on. Let's move on. Thank you for your sharing. All right, now. We are going to play a little game here. It's called a guessing game. Tai Dong Si. You gotta, you gotta guess. I want you to Tai. You gotta guess who is that person. But before we go into that, let's learn some new words. Let's learn some new words. Firstly, say with me. Earn. You can switch. Earn. Earn. Earn means make. When you say earn money, it means make money. You get what I'm saying? Let's move on. Extra. 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 Good. Extra means more. You want to make more. You want to earn extra. Okay. Next up. Let's say let's say it together. Gay. 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 All right, I want you to look at this picture. Now, this is a gay. You get what I'm saying? This is a gay. All right, next up, say with me. Aquarium. Aquarium. All right, children, do you know that to clean an aquarium is not easy? It's not easy to clean an Aquarium. So, another way for you to earn money, okay? To help cleaning the aquarium. And if you don't clean it well, the fish may die, children. So, if you want to clean an aquarium, it's like more than a half hour job. All right, next up, say with me, porch. 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 Okay. So, children, for this word, I would like all of you to look inside this picture. Can you look inside this picture? Yeah. Well, behind the gate, there is a place where your parents park their cars, and usually it's covered by roof. Now, this is a porch. Uh, in Chinese, we call it Che Fang. Now, in the US, they do have a garage. In the United States, they actually have a room to park your cars inside a, a room, you know? All right, that's a special, garage. that's a garage. But in Malaysia, we seldom have a garage because we are not, you know, as luxury, as luxurious as the Americans. So we have a car porch. Do you know that cleaning up the car porch is not easy? Because the car porch is usually dirty by the tires, roll on, by the car, so it's not easy to clean a porch. So you got another way to make money to to clean up, right? All right, let's move on. Let's move on, children. Let's move on. Let's play a game. It's called a guessing game. All right, children. First, uh, I would need uh, Jingyi. Do you think you can use your microphone to talk? If you can talk, can you? Give me a like if you cannot, you put a cross. Do you think you can talk, Jingyi? Can you say something, Jingyi? Say yes. Yes. All right, good. Jingyi, I need you to read the instruction. Can you read the girls do different things? Can you start reading now? Here, uh, the instruction. Yeah, the girls do different things. Different things to... Earn extra money, live and guess. Go get what the who the person is. Who the person is. Thank you, Jingyi. Thank you so much. Now, children, 
I'm going to start telling, all of you can switch on your microphone. You have to be really fast to be the winner. All right? So all of you switch on your microphone. And children, I'm going to start telling some, some sentences and see who can guess who the person is. There are four persons here. Kima, Kisha, Prisha, and Lila. So let's begin. Let's see who that person is now. The first person, children, are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. All right, I wish all of you are ready. The first person, she helps her parents to wash car and she earns six ringgit. And then she helps, yeah. who is that? Me. All right, you got it correct. That's Hima, thank you very much. Next up. All right, another person. Let's see who can guess it right. Now, this girl, she helps her parents to wash the porch and she earned four in it and she made... Lila. And That's Prisha. Thank you. That's Prisha. All right, Prisha. Oh, I haven't finished. Prisha also helps herself by making and selling key rings for 16 ringgit. Wow. Wow. All right, this is the same as Lila. One more. All right, Prisha, she also washed aquarium for three ringgit. Okay, one more. All right, let's continue. All right, this girl, she helps her parents to paint the gate, to paint the gate for 20 ringgit. Prisha, thank you very much. Thanks for your participation. Now, as you all look at these four girls, do you all learn something from them? They do jobs at home. They do jobs at home and earn money. So this is what we can learn from them. Okay, now I'm going to tell you, I need you to uh, write this down. If you have a pencil, uh, do you have a, a book or a piece of paper? Please write down my email account now. You got to send an email to me, children. Write down my email account. G minus one nice... 361864 Elias MOE minus DL dot Please write this down now. Copy it down, record it at one of the places that you can find either a piece of paper or a book. Can you please write this down? Because I want you to send an email. And later on, I'm going to show you how to send an email in just a short while, children. All right, so firstly, all of you will need to. All of you will need to write down my email. So this is my email account. Today you got to send me an email. Okay. Now this is what I want you to do in your email, children. 在你的email, uh, inside your email, this is what you should write in a week's time. In a week's time, 在一个星期里面, seven days. You got to write down your own name. 你写你自己的名字. Don't write Matthew Chi, uh, children. Write your own name. Write Kong Chen Jack. Write Fu Jia Wei. Write Wang Jing Yi. Write Chong Jai Wei. Write Wang uh, Chong Ka Hao. Write Li Shi Mans. Write your own name. Say zi zi de ming zi. Extra income. E Y Sou Lu. Say xia lai ni men de E Y Sou Lu. And then you write down R M. Malaysia the Chen B R M washing the car Bang Baba Mama Sita washing the car five ring in making and selling paper planes Alright I just simply put it out uh, maybe nobody will want to buy your paper planes pulling out weeds pulling out weeds maybe you can make five ring in from your parents by helping to pull out weeds. Now, it's not just these three activities, you know, children. I want you to think. I want you to think. What other ways can you have your parents so that they can give you a little extra money? Then, at the end of it, you need to write down the total money that you have earned from staying at home and doing some tough jobs. If you earn only one ringgit, no problem. I just want to know, okay? You just let me know. 
只是如果一个星期你赚到一零级 extra money， never mind， you just let me know。But what I want you to do is to send an email to me. So now, can I teach you how to send an email, children? Can I teach you how to send an email? Can or not? All right. So, firstly, I'm gonna turn this off, and I'm gonna teach you how to send an email. Okay. So just a moment, just a moment. I'm going to my Google. I'm going to my Google and going to show you how to send an email. All right. Just a moment. Okay, good. All right. Firstly, children, I'm gonna、uh, shrink my Internet Explorer so that all of you can see it. Just a moment. I'm dragging it, and you are actually seeing it already. All right. So, can you see my Internet Explorer now? You see my Internet Explorer. Yours is usually white. Mine is black, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna turn off this Zoom. I'm gonna go to. Ah,、uh, Gmail. So, children, this is how you use your email. You go to Gmail. You know what is Gmail, All right? Now, firstly, if you log into your Google Classroom, let me show you your Google Classroom. This is your Google Classroom. If you go into your Google Classroom, so children, do you see these nine dots? This is the menu. You click on the menu and you click Gmail. You get what I'm saying? You click Gmail.、Uh, once you enter your Google Classroom, this is your Google Classroom. You go to the nine dots menu, and you go to and you go to Gmail. You get what I'm saying? You go to Gmail. Right after that, once you reach your Gmail, you go to Compose. You go to Compose the plus,、uh, the Google Sign Plus. Compose is loading. It's opening. So you compose means you write a email. I want you to write a email to me. So it's opening in just a moment. It's loading, ah,、uh, it's loading. So once it's open, then I can show you. It's opening. So you use from compose, children. You use from compose. Okay. Then there's a new message. You can type my email account here: g minus one nine three six one eight six four alias m o e minus d l dot e d u dot m y. Then the subject I want you to write money. Sorry, I want you to write your name: Bu Jia Wei's extra. Income. Okay, then you can start by uh uh not typing. Sorry, not typing. Alright, you type R M. Any question? Can you ask a question now? My name is F U Fu. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, F U right? Okay, I'm gonna change it. So uh, can you follow? She can the sound the tell me okay. Can the sound the. If you can follow me, can you switch on your microphone and tell me, okay, teacher? Okay. All right, good. Then maybe you、okay. can you can write down, wash the car, wash the car. Then how much money that your parents give you? You 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 have to like move your arm a little bit more, and you put five ringgit. And then at the end of the day, you put down total. 你总共赚了多少钱 You put down the total. Okay, I believe all of you have figured it out. 谁已经完全记得了的举手 Okay, you got seven days to do this. You have seven days to do this job. Each and every one of you must send me an email, including your friends who are not in the class now. You know why, children? Because I'm gonna put this recording on YouTube, and I'm gonna share the link of this lesson in our Google Classroom. So just now, Shiman and Jingyi. Came in late. You 们两个迟到 but it's okay. Doesn't matter because you can check back the YouTube video. You can start learning from the beginning until the end again. All right, children. Now, if you forget what to do, just watch my YouTube lesson video again. All right. So this is your classwork for this week, and I'll see you again on Tuesday next week, same time, eleven thirty a.m. Goodbye, children. Goodbye. Bye.